This is the fight of our lives. Every journey has an end game. Who hasn't been to space? You better not throw up on my ship. Avengers and Gay. Rated PG-13. Tickets available now. What's going on, guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name is Michael Roman. A ton of Avengers Endgame footage actually got shown yesterday, but if you don't share a time zone with South Korea, there's a chance you were asleep as Marvel Studios on a press tour yesterday aired the first 20 minutes of Avengers Endgame. We're going to break down everything that was said about that and also go over the new footage that we got in this TV spot. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we're giving away two PlayStation 4 Pros as well as a whole slew of other Marvel-related stuff, including tickets to go see Avengers Endgame in IMAX. All you have to do, hit the subscribe button, then hit the notification bell, leave a like and a comment on this video, and if you want, stick around to the end of the video. I'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there. So first things first, guys, I realize that the audio and the video quality on that TV clip are not the greatest, but as of right now, 4.10 a.m. on Sunday morning, this is the best quality of this clip that we can find anywhere on the internet. Now, it may be the case that they release an HD widescreen version of this, I don't know, in like three or four hours, but I had stayed up all night Saturday waiting for any reports to come out of South Korea, and it was just a bonus that I ran into this clip. So I'm making this video now, and I apologize about the quality. So we got actually a couple of good clips in this. We got a couple of shots of Captain Marvel, one specifically with her on the front lawn in front of the Avengers Mansion. This looks like the same night shot where we see everybody coming out, we think presumably to meet a crashing Tony. There's been a couple of reports now out of a couple of different camps that have seen this first 20 minute clip, this sanctioned first 20 minutes they've been showing people. And it seems to report that Tony and Nebula are going to get back to Earth and just crash right there. So I think it logically follows that Captain Marvel is going to do her best at that point to power up and go catch the ship and assist in its landing to Earth. Now the next new scene we see is finally Rocket turning around and asking the rest of the ship who's never been to space, followed by the admonishment not to throw up in his ship. And really, we heard about this from the shareholders meeting, so it's no great reveal. But we do get a new shot of Ronin with the backdrop of space followed by these power-up shots of Captain Marvel. Now, of course, you can clearly see this is a day sky here, so these are not the same scenes from when she's on the lawn. But through the context and lens of the Russo's most three recent interviews, where they've basically said we might have just shot shots just for the trailer that have nothing to do with the movie on purpose, I don't know what to believe about any of this anymore. You'd like to think there's some sanctity in the first 20 minutes. Now, about... Speaking of those first 20 minutes, everyone who saw the footage did say that it was a real tearjerker, that it was very solemn and that it was very sad. And from the get go, there really wasn't this feeling of revenge, which, wait a minute, is pretty much the opposite of what uh, everyone had said was the first 15 to 20 minutes of this film. And if you go ahead and take all that and compare it to what the Russos just said in their last interview, about them specifically filming scenes to throw us off. Literally just filming scenes for the trailer, not just CGI alterations. I'm beginning to think that we haven't seen any of Avengers Endgame yet. Guys, let me know what you think in the comments. What level of misleading could they have been up to this point? And of course, what do you think of the limited new frames we got could have been fake out of this? And let's get into the giveaway stuff before I let you go. All right, we're giving away two PlayStation 4 Pros at the 300 and 400,000 subscriber mark. We're also giving away tickets to go see Avengers Endgame in IMAX every Wednesday and Friday, as well as these awesome Marvel Trendsetters limited edition, limited run film cell plaques containing an original film cell from each movie which they represent. Unfortunately, guys, sorry, the Civil War one has already been claimed if you want to win any of this stuff the tickets the plaques the playstations all you got to do hit the subscribe button then hit the notification bell leave a like and a comment on the video and the more videos that you like and comment on the better chance you have of winning my name is michael roman this is everything always thanks for checking out the channel guys and stick around we'll be posting again real real soon and now i'm gonna take my butt to bed because it's like i don't know what am and the sun is coming up so